Straight this way. Reasonably happy on the end as well. Okay. <laughs> Today we're beginning the construction of this wonderful new training facility at Leicester College. And what it'll do is to enable them to provide over 100 students with the skills that they need for uh, particularly the motor vehicle uh, industry, but uh, others beyond that, uh, but particularly to contribute to the local economy in a way that Leicester College does so successfully. <laughs> At the moment, we don't have the space to take people beyond level two in motor vehicle engineering, and now we'll be able to go beyond that to higher levels. That's also in line with government policy, the fact that we need to make sure that people have a progression route through to employment and ultimately to higher education if that's what they want to do. And we'll be able to support more apprenticeships. The cost overall is sort of shy of about four million, and we're very fortunate to be getting about two thirds of that uh, granted to us by the Leicester and Leicestershire Enterprise Partnership. The Local Enterprise Partnership is, is, a, is a partnership between businesses, and we've got about eight or nine businesses on our board, FE Colleges, HE and the public sector. Um, this is the first part of this project, but actually skills is right at the heart of our agenda. A lot of local companies who I work with every day at the moment are, are really reporting a lot of skill shortages. And the problem is sometimes is that FE Colleges or HE Colleges aren't always actually given the right type of skills to their students for when, they, for when they actually leave school to get the jobs. Um, what this college will do is actually start focusing very specifically on those types of skills that businesses are looking for. 